Since the dawn of time, mankind has looked up at the heavens wondering, how do we get here? And on the opposite side of the spectrum, we have also asked, how will this all end? This unusual question of death has often come with many different answers. Some paint a grim picture of man's ultimate self-annihilation, wars, famine, political turmoil, economic collapse. Others point at Earth and tell us how our planet has reached its peak of patience and simply decided to instill an act of purification. Our self-righteous attitude of polluting and abusing that which has given us life could easily be squashed when the world has simply decided it had enough. And amongst all the other possibilities, we are left pondering. What does it mean? Does it really matter? Well, perhaps it does, for the good of our offspring and our future generations. Perhaps this view of destruction doesn't translate to how we would normally view it. Perhaps it is the death of an older way of living, an older way of thinking, of understanding that our lives are all intertwined and that we are all one and the same. Maybe it's time for those old ideals to be laid to rest. They have served their purpose, and so, in order for life to transcend, we must evolve our way of thinking. Join PRS for our look at this long overdue change that is due to arrive at the end of this year.